Hey guys, it is that time of the year. It is CES 2024 and I'm so excited because I'm going to be doing a lot with TCL so I'm basically going to be hanging out there. So not sure what we're going to be, you know, getting into with this vlog but got coffee, got my badge, gonna go see my sister. She's actually hosting with Brian Tong the entire CES. So let's go see if we can find her. Okay, so I found Justine, but I forgot to put her in the vlog. She's a very busy lady since she's literally hosting CES. Um, I saw Brian, saw Justine. Now I'm gonna go in to the Central Hall and find the TCL booth. This is really cool because like no one's really here yet and it hasn't really started until 10. So it's gonna be packed and it's gonna be a good time. Okay, not gonna lie to you guys, this booth is incredible. There is so much going on. There's gaming. There's 115 inch TVs. This is gonna be fun. All right, it's day two here at CES. I've actually been here for the past couple of hours filming. Yesterday was a crazy busy day with TCL. I was basically at the booth all day long, went back to the hotel, did some edits, and then I went to a party where I met Nelly, and Nelly performed for a very intimate, small group of people at the TCL event, and it honestly, was incredible. I would just like to say, Nelly, very personable, very funny, very nice. I shook his hand twice and I told him, thank you for being my hero as a child. So that was pretty cool. So like I said, I've spent most of my time here at the TCL booth so far. I've been doing a lot of hosting for them as well as making a lot of content for myself. And some of the big announcements that they made were the 115 inch QD mini LED TV which, not gonna lie, this is a massive TV, and seeing it in the show floor, I'm like, okay, like, it's still pretty big, but it's like not obnoxiously big. Like, I actually love it, and like, I can see this somehow in my living room. Also, we have like the 98 inch, which my sister actually has, and seeing that in real life too, I was like, this is a 98 inch. It's just, it's really cool, like, seeing the, all the new technology and all the new announcements and being able to spend so much time here and learn about the tech has been really, really fun. There's also a really cool gaming setup, so check this out. Ooh. Another thing that's cool is TCL is the official partner of Call of Duty as well as the NFL. So I got to meet Bo Jackson, I got to hang out with Charles Woodson, and I've also got to play Call of Duty while I've been here. So basically just having the best time uh, at the booth and checking everything out, which is a bit of last. So I just wrapped my shooting with TCL. I'm gonna do a little walk around the convention center and see what I can see. Gonna go stop by, see my friends at Sony, and just kind of see whatever is happening uh, on the show floor. Ooh, Bugatti, we got scooters. Okay, now we're gonna check out the Sony Parker. Turismo real driving simulator. How fun! So I spend most of my time walking around CES and then stopping to talk to my friends and talk to people and meet people, and it's so incredible. Uh, we're gonna be moving on where I just checked out the Sony booth, so much good stuff happening there. But now I'm at the Insta360 booth, so let's see, let's see what's going on here. I guess I'm getting. Is it yeah, put your arms up. Okay. Oh my word. <laughs> wait, 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 yeah, other arms. All right, okay. <laughs> I can't even see you in there. <laughs> it's all blacked out. It's so good. <laughs> oh, don't trip. Please don't trip. There are shoes and gloves as well. Is it coming out? So I don't think that Rivian has an official booth here at CES this year, but I remember either 2019 or 2020, one of those years, the reason I actually discovered Rivian was because I saw them at CES. There's a Rivian truck here. It's an unreal uh, experience that it's a part of, uh, but it's just really cool because seeing this Rivian at CES and it being the reason that I got it, full circle. LG has a transparent TV, which we just checked out. This booth is absolutely crazy right now. I'm gonna walk around and see what else I can see. This is also 
pretty cool. This is like an experimental camper by LG where they've got like all this incredible tech built in and like the shower. Very futuristic, very high tech, and pretty cool. So basically has like all the LG appliances that would be more than ideal for these like camping situations. It's amazing. So I'm heading out a little bit early. I just wanted to do a quick little walk through the show floor. Obviously I spent most of my time working with TCL and it was so much fun, but definitely got to see so many friends. I got to see a few cool things at CES. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna head back. I gotta do some work now. And I'll see you guys in a little bit because the vlog's not over. We're gonna, we're gonna continue it. I just don't know what we're gonna do. back to the hotel and you know what is incredible after talking for days and your throat is just like raw ice cream well it's like a frozen yogurt type of situation this is incredible this is exactly what I want cake batter and uh, cookies and cream so my last minute impulsive decision to not fly and to drive to Vegas is because my little baby boy came with me and we've been staying at the park MGM and it's so dog friendly and they have like all of these incredible like dog services and there's a little pee pee pad outside like a tiny little area that's um, like all fenced in which has been incredible and he's been having so much fun. He just loves being like a part of everything and oh get comfy. We're gonna go potty, bud, and then we're gonna go to bed. So I got back and I've just been editing for the past like three hours, just like stories and reels and not even this vlog yet. I'm the slowest editor in the world because I'm constantly distracted. Go to the potty, let's go potty. Okay, officially starting the road trip back. I've got a full charge, which is incredible. I'm gonna stop at the Arabian Network in Barstow. Perfect uh, in-between spot, charge, drink, pee, get food. Uh, back to LA. I'm, I'm more than ready to go back and get some sun. I'm very cold. All right, so the drive is going well. Stopped back in Barstow, which is where I usually stop when I'm doing the road trips to Vegas or when I drove to Utah. Uh, this is the Rivian Adventure Network which used to be free the past month or so. They changed it so you have to pay. But it's great because it's automatically connected to my car and to my phone, so I have a credit card on file with my Rivian app. Uh, so I plug it in, and we're gonna get a little a little fast charge. Uh, I stopped through the Panera drive through I got some soup and a grilled cheese. There's a Starbucks here. So it's actually pretty convenient. Um, it's a nice little break, too. We're getting juiced up, and we're almost home. Which is good, because my voice is like, basically gone. So I'm ready. So I made it back to Los Angeles. Now this CES definitely was very like goal oriented for me. Like I had a lot of, you know, work things that I was doing and I was like, oh, I feel like I didn't actually see that much tech and I feel like I didn't really do a lot. But then I think back and I'm like, oh, well I met Nelly. I went to like a very private, intimate concert. I met Bo Jackson, I met Charles Woodson. I saw so many of my friends, um, but I did do a really bad job of filming. So that is where I apologize. But this was just a quick little video showing you guys a little bit of what I saw at CES. Next year, I'm gonna be better. I'm gonna have a whole team and you're gonna conquer CES 2025 but in the meantime I'm gonna rest up because my body is still very mad at me uh, and tired so I will see you guys again soon I'm excited for all the content that's gonna be coming 2024 so make sure you subscribe we're gonna do cool stuff this year right now we're gonna take a nap bye